Happy Monday, Jousters. Monday, March 23rd. We've got a fun one for you today. Here's what we're looking at. Uh, I want you all to start with the at-home joust standard warm-up today. Find that warm-up on our YouTube channel. Uh, there's also a link in the WAD blog as well. Uh, after that at-home warm-up, we're going to knock out six rounds for time. Ten renegade rows. That's ten total, five each arm. We've got 15 V-ups, 20 lateral bell hops. Our goal for this workout, as always, have fun, move well, and let's try to get it in between 12 and 15 minutes. If you beat 12 minutes, awesome. Just make sure you're moving well and having fun. Scaling options for this workout today. In place of those renegade rows, if you don't have a dumbbell, find an odd object, something with a little weight, something you can row up and back down. You can also do invisible rows from that push-up position. In place of the V-ups, we could do a two-legged tuck-up. We could do a single leg tuck up. In place of the lateral bell hops, we can do an odd object lateral hop, jumping over an object. We can also do invisible lateral hops. We could also do jumping jacks. I've got Cassie for us today. That's, she's gonna demo all of our movement standards. For the renegade rows, you're gonna have your hands on both sides of the bell. From there, pick the bell up, keep the elbow tight, row up, row down, and then switch. We're looking at 10 total renegade rows. That's five each arm, alternating left, right, left, right. Your feet can be shoulder width apart. Make sure you keep the body one straight line. Options for scaling here, find an odd object. If you got a water jug at home, awesome. Put it to good use. If you don't have an object to row with, you can do invisible renegade rows. Row with your body, alternating left, right, left, right. Still maintaining that one straight line position. For the V-ups, I'm going to start and finish in hollow body position. V-up with both legs, meet in the middle. Try to get those shoulders off the ground every single time. If we need to scale this, let's go to a two-legged tuck-up. Scale a little more, let's go to a single leg tuck-up. Scale a little more, we can go to sit-ups. And our last movement for the workout today, we've got lateral bell hops. If you have a dumbbell, you're going to do 20 total hops, jumping from left side of the bell to right side of the bell. If you don't have a dumbbell, go to that odd object. Same thing, 20 lateral hops. Don't have an odd object, find a seam, a crack in your floor, jump over that crack. 20 times. We could also go to the tried and true jumping jack, jumping jack. That's our wad brief for Monday, March 23rd. Kick butt, have fun.